DP again, again with my friend Stephen Nelford. Today we're going to be looking at intermediate pad work, beginner to intermediate pad work. What we're going to try to do in this instance is combinations as well as phases of attack. I'll go into that in a little bit more depth in the next point. Combination basically means in boxing two or more punches together in a sequence. In this instance, what we're going to be looking at is a jab, a cross, a left hook. That's a combination, and that is in actual fact a four punch combination because he's using four punches. Go. One more time. There we go. Notice when he's using these punches with a, with a point, if you throw the jab, his right hand's in position for his next shot, he's nice and tight. As his cross goes, his left hand's back in position. As his left hand goes, his right hand's there. So with every shot, he's always nice and tight. He's never lifting his chin up. He's staying nice and composed, nice and tight. Go. One, two, left, across, practice that. We're gonna move now onto the next phase of attack. That is a combination followed by a defense, followed by another combination. So in the instance with this, with the one, two, left, across, that, even though it's four punches, is only one phase of attack because he's stayed in there, it's all done in one phase. What he's gonna do now, after he completes that last right hand, he's gonna step right. Now he's gonna go right hand, left hand, okay? So that would be two phases of attack, with seven punches. So he's going. One, two, three. Right, step. Right, step. Okay. Two phases. The start of the first phase is this. That's the end of the first phase. Now this is the start of the second. Okay. So he goes there. One, two, left, right. One more time. Nice and sharp, Steve. Yeah. So Steve's going to turn the tempo up now. Ready? So that is a four punch, comp a, a seven punch combination with two phases of attack. Practice that. We're going to add one last phase in the last part of the video. That two phase attack. Now this is where we really start working our boxing skill. When we start coming off our opponent, coming back on, that's when we're more likely to catch them on the counter on the return phase. We're going to add that now. We're going to add a phase onto that. So it's not going to be a two phase attack anymore. It's going to be a three, three phase attack. He's going to do it slow. This was the first two phases you've already done. One, two, cross. You've already done that part. You've gone right, left, right. That was the last part of the last video. This time, what he's going to do now is going to roll up under. Start to the third phase. Okay, we're going to put that together. Here we go. One more time to me on that wall, Steve, while I want it to do as you roll, or into step as well. Okay? Again, last time. Three phases. So we've got four punches, three punches, and three punches. Go. One, Slide it down, if you can perfect that, it's really going to start to help your boxing. You're moving from out to the beginner phase now, more into intermediate boxing. Remember, from me to you, EP Boxing, don't just take part, it's all about high focus.